You know what we're doing here? What? We're crushing skulls. Whoa! <laughs> what kind of wizardry do you have in store for you us? Know, I don't even know if we're gonna. If it's technically, it's more of a just a, a tricep extension, right? We call it a skull crusher when we use dumbbells because well, it looks like a skull crusher. Yeah, when on the bench. but uh, and so it's a similar elbow positioning. What I like about cables, though, especially with focus sessions, is the the consistent tension that you're keeping in that. Yeah, area. there's no change in resistance right? because of gravity and you know whatever. So, like in other videos, we've demonstrated uh, cable or I mean uh, dumbbell skull crushers, but when you're at the very top of that exercise with dumbbells. Bells, there's not as much tension on the tricep as there are when you're in a cable. So I'll take a cable. I like to do single arm. You can do both arm, but I like to focus sessions. So I'm really trying to focus on keeping myself stabilized, really focus on the area that I'm trying to pump blood to and work on. So I'll get my split stance. I want my elbow uh, uh, or parallel to the floor. I'm going to take the opposite arm so I can hold that elbow into that position. I'm going to let the cable pull myself all the way back. I don't want it to pull my shoulder back. I want to keep it in that fixed position, but I want to take it through full range of motion right here and I extend all the way out. Squeeze hard. Come all the way back. Full, yes. full, full range of motion. motion. Yes, exactly. Very important. Also, pay attention to his stance. He has a split stance, but you'll notice the arm that's forward, his leg is also forward on that same side. If he switched, and, stand, and did a split stance the other way, he'd find himself perhaps twisting a little bit. This helps keep his body pointing forward, locked into position, so all he does is have, all he has to do is focus on the tricep. Which That's is, a great point. Then I would switch to my right side. If I were to switch to my right side, I'd grab the other independent, and then just like you said, bring that right leg forward right. now. Help prevent that, that twist. Key though is really keeping that elbow in a stationary position, taking it through full range of motion.